Hello everyone, my name is Aiden and welcome to this video. So first of all, I want to say thank you for all of the support that I've been receiving on my videos. It's been, you know, it's pretty amazing. All of you leave in these comments and uh, it's great to see that you guys are enjoying the content that I put out. Because for me, I enjoy making the videos, but most of all, I enjoy reading your guys' comments. You know, if you guys can take something away from my video, have it be, you know, some information, something you've learned, or you just enjoyed the video in general, so it's, made, it's brightened up your day, that is... That comes back to me and that brightens up my day so it's a it's a good circle a good pattern we got there and i also love seeing everyone being kind in the comments down below like i said you know in my previous video i like it when you know everyone gets along there's not too much squabbling and all that so you know you guys keep i love read i love going through the comments people being kind to each other helping each other out i've seen a bunch of you have made a couple of friends you've added each other started in storm chest yourself and that is awesome so what i wanted to do was I went through my videos and saw and basically I was analysing them to see which ones you guys enjoyed the most. And one of them being the Storm Chest video which has quite a substantial amount of views. And um, uh, I, you know it's 10 Storm Chests from level 100 missions and I thought right people are loving that. Um, let's give back to them that I haven't made a Storm Chest video in a while and that it's always brand new and unique we never know what we're going to get. And what I did say in that video was I would do a bunch of chests and I would also store away all my Sunbeam, Brightcore, Obsidian and Shadow Shard so uh, we could see how much I would get from the chests altogether. Now I'd done that, but I'd done, uh, well I've done 30 Storm Chests and I haven't checked my loot. Um, the closest I got to check in was by accident and I didn't actually check it. So when I was dismantling my weapons and... Um, you know, when I was dismantling them, I might have jumped over a tab, but yeah. So we got, we're going to check all the loot together at the end, and we're going to see what we get. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys at the end for when we go over the loot. Leave me here, you never good enough. Won't change a thing now, there was never tried. Don't you say a word, cause I've heard it all You were just a pain when you felt it all oh. Something tells me that I won't miss it It's the first time that we can't fix it It's irreversible damage done The thrill is gone Ooh, baby, I ain't no one like you You chose to keep the truth inside Choose to keep the truth in 
And there we have it, guys. That is the showcase of the Storm Chest. Not all 30 were in that, like, that selection there. They were just some of the good ones. Like, obviously, I didn't want to just throw all 30 in. But, you know, it made up for the song, and I think that was pretty good. So now we're going to check out this loot together. So I haven't checked it. I'm quite curious to see what we get from 30 chests. And uh, let's pretty much get straight into it. So let's hit up our backpack and see if it has the map. Okay, over two ingredients. Ooh, wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. Um, okay. Wow. <laughs> I'm actually pretty surprised because... Um, Damn, man. I mean, we've got 53 Bright Core and 52 Sunbeam. So that's quite a consistent amount. I would have assumed we would have got quite a bit more Bright Core than the Sunbeam. And then here we have four... We have exactly four... Oh, wait. No, I thought we had 400 Obsidian. Nope, we have... Uh, <laughs> no, I read that wrong. So we've got a whole stack of Obsidian. So 200 Obsidian and then an additional 20. And then we also have another stack of 200 Shadow Shards and 16 shadow shard as well so for the total of 220 obsidian 216 shadow shard and that actually cuts really close as well i would have assumed we would have got a lot more obsidian than we would have shadow shard but um that's really awesome actually getting that much you know getting a stack of each and uh you know an additional pretty much 20 each and then 50 in each bright core and sunbeam that's pretty awesome uh, efficient mechanical park, so 33, that will be from dismantling, 109 sleek, so we got that just from dismantling, and then if we go down a bit, we should have 79 oxidized, oxidized mineral powder, that's pretty good, uh, char black, um, I can't remember how much it had on me, so we'll go for the 78, I might have left a stack on me, so we'll go for 78, uh, then I believe we must have got around about 80 bacon, I think you can get bacon from the storm chest unless I've picked some up somewhere. But I'm pretty sure I didn't have that much in my third stack. So I would assume around 80. And then we got exactly 600 coal. That's pretty goddamn lucky. So we must have got a bunch of coal from that. I probably had around 400 on me. I didn't really think about the coal and bacon and stuff. I was just I primarily went for the bright core, obsidian and shadow shard. And obviously the sunbeam there. And obviously the two mechanical parts. And I mean... We have a really clean view here. I mean, it's actually it actually goes to show that obsidian is, you know, as common as shadow shard. I mean, you know, we normally use our obsidian or bright core at a lower value. I think it will stay like that because um, it's used for rocket launches. So, you know, stuff you can quickly get rid of. But, yeah, it goes to show that, I mean, there's quite a consistent rate. Um, anything else that out of the ordinary? No. So, that is that. So, I'm pretty chuffed with that. I mean, that's pretty goddamn awesome. And if you guys enjoyed this video, I mean, be sure to leave a like and uh, comment down below the, if you've done level 100 storm chests and what you've got out of them. I mean, um, they're pretty crazy. One of the best things to do in this game is to farm them if you're looking for these sort of materials. I mean, if you're getting bright core and sunbeam, these are the two that you mainly... May, wow, English, Aiden. Wow. You mainly farm the storm chests for. Um, because, you know, if you go around the map looking for them, you're not going to have too much of a chance. So, it 30 chest took us around, I think it must have been between an hour and 40 minutes to two hours. I'm pretty sure it was around that time. I mean, uh, me and my friends, we just grinded all the way through. And then, you know, it only took a couple of minutes to find the, the uh, chest and get on with it. But yeah, I mean, that makes up for that. <laughs> and like I said, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.